hello everyone welcome back to another video i hope you are all doing fine so in today's video i will be showing you my um shoe collection well some of my shoes not all of them because not all of them are worth showing in the sense that i've already worn them and they're like in a state but whatever anyway the first shoe that i am going to start off with is from quiz um for those that who don't know that is a website and that is the brand of the shoes so let's open them as you can see they are still in the box i have not worn them or used them uh, brand new um, i actually purchased these from um was it the double uh, no was it the bro yeah it was the broadway shopping center and I got, I think, 10% off them. I don't remember. But as you can see, they've come in its package to keep them protected. And I have not worn them yet. So, yeah. Anyway, let's take them out of there. So, as you can see, how beautiful are them? Really nice. Um, They've got, like, silver beading on them. And they're flat. They're not high at all. They've just got a teeny weeny whiny little heel. I wouldn't even class that as a heel, but... I mean, whatever you would call them. And they've got all diamonds around the edge. Really comfortable. Really nice. So, well, they're comfortable when I tried them on. I haven't worn them outside yet, but yeah. So that is my first uh, pair that I haven't worn yet. So I thought I'll show you. Next is uh, my... I do not know how to pronounce um, this designer's name um if i'm just going to show you the box because i don't want to pronounce it wrong um but that is the designer which i purchased from house of fraser and this is the box that they've come in and on top is a little well not a little but a bag to put my shoes in to keep them protected which I really like and the heels itself are these blue turquoise um, glitter high heels absolutely stunning perfect for um, your Christmas or for basically any parties Eid um well basically whenever you dress up and you're in a mood to wear heels super comfortable really nice and yeah that's my next pair so there you have it Should just see if it's showing properly on the camera yeah so yeah moving on so the next uh box is some of my heels and shoes that I have got are not actually in the boxes that are new that I've purchased. But as long as they're protected. So the next heel is ha that had no box, no uh, wrapping, nothing. I've actually just found spare tissue to keep them protected. Uh, these heels. So I'm just going to... That are from New Look. The um classic red and it's a block heel really 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 comfortable and um i got them on sale actually as you can see they were for 19.99 down to nine pounds um so yeah really cute I haven't worn them yet brand new excited to wear them so moving on let's move all this out of the way to the next shoe is my, I actually got these as a gift from my sister and again I haven't worn them yet. These are some pink uh, pointed heels, um, not that high, I'd say about half like middle size of a heel. I don't know what you would call that, what's the actual right name for it but yeah. Um, and they're from Dorothy Perkins and she bought me them for my birthday. So cute. Haven't worn them yet, but really cute. They're like a nude, but pinky nude. So, yeah. 
there you have it really cute really nice and that's the heel okay moving on um to the next box is my head over heels by dune i think i don't know if i'm right but the heels that are in here again are from my mum are they yeah they're the ones that my mum bought for me for my birthday which i haven't got a chance to wear and especially now that it's corona you can't go out you can't party like do parties or go out or anywhere you know where you'd expect to wear them but anyway that is my next pair um they um like a white silver but with a pink in it mixture of pink and let's see you can't see this really comfortable as you can see i haven't worn them I don't know why it's got dirt on them, but whatever. Really nice. So, yeah, that's my next pair. So, next one are my next heels. I think they're my heels. Um, these that I purchased myself last year from Next. As you can see, Forever Comfort. And the wedges really comfortable because even if i don't I haven't worn them yet i know for a the fact they're going to be comfortable because wedges you can't go wrong with them and as you can see this is an ankle area um it's got like stones on them super cute it's got a zip on the back and um that is the front of them and yeah and i purchased these for 40 pounds Oh, my next uh, heels, I think the heels are from Kurt Geiger, which are my recent, recent pair that I have not worn at all. And I've, these are my list, latest pair of heels that I purchased. And I got them from um, Debenhams. So as you can see, they're packed away properly. I have not opened them or worn them or anything yet. So I'm just going to take them out of the box to show you. So, oh wow, stunning. There you have it. That They are the new pair. Um, they've got the stud on them, studs on them. The design is like plastic, the clear plastic design. On the bottom, it's got the KG... Um, sign on it and the heel is um more than a finger long pointing finger as you can see really nice um actually find them really really beautiful as you can see inside it's the kg sign as well got and kurt geiger written underneath um i don't remember how much i purchased these for let me see if it says it on the box um it does yeah 59 pounds so yeah really happy about them as well can't wait to wear them but hopefully very soon soon as this lockdown is over so my next pair of heels that i have worn but i absolutely love so much are from faith uh, Faith, um, they sell them in um, Debenhams, I forgot the word then, and obviously as you can see I've worn them, but it's got the name on them, and they're like a velvet material, super comfortable, and they are pointy, and that's how long the heel is. Um, and I'm not, I don't remember how much I purchased these for, it's been a while, but absolutely love them, one of my favourite pair of heel shoes so yeah moving on to my next footwear uh <clears throat> this gold collection by i have not p I don't, hold on a second does it say it in a better yeah no it doesn't but anyway it's gold collection i bought these from 
um, an Asian store which is called Janan. I don't know if anybody's heard of it, but it's a Pakistani store where they sell all Pakistani clothes, um, wedding stuff and everything. And I haven't worn them yet. As you can see, they are in the original package. So I'm just going to take it out to show you. So it's in the, like one of these bags to keep it protected. And there you have it. They are stunning. Really, really nice. Um, they've got diamonds on them. They're like a dark, like a brown gold, if that makes sense. With diamonds on them. Really nice. And it's straps and um strap is like this so yeah super cute really happy about them can't wait to use them i'm sure you've realized i like very blingy blingy type of heels I'm a, i like wearing bright um stuff i don't mind dull things but i'm more on the bright side but anyway <laughs> moving on to the next box is um what's in here oh right is these gold uh pointies there you have it and there's a heel i have not worn them yet um and i've purchased them from dorothy am i right yeah dorothy perkins for 25 pounds so yeah that's the next pair moving on to my next pair of heels ah uh, my cavella heels that again i purchased from Debenhams. um so yeah, let's open them. I have already worn them before. I absolutely, absolutely love them. They are one of my favourite heels. Well, I must say they're not comfortable to wear for very long. Um, so there you have it. And how much did I purchase these for? I purchased these for... Let me just show you on the box. Um, 9 so... I mean, not nine ninety nine. What am I saying? My bad. Ninety nine pounds. I wish nine ninety nine. <laughs> but no, ninety nine pounds. Um, they jewel. Uh, they've got like jewels on them. They're studded. Um, as you can see, super cute. Really nice. Like I said, they're not um something that I would wear for hours and hours because they are not comfortable to wear for a very long time. They definitely get your feet tired and they start hurting, but I'm really happy. A really nice design and yeah, these are Cavella heels. So yeah, moving on to my next pair of shoes. Um, are my, these are from Very. I have worn them before, but... The V by Very, as you can see, and I have definitely worn these before. I think I've only worn them the once, and they are quite a big heel, very high. I think these are the highest I have got, and they're like gold, but with a bit of silver glitter in them, as you can see. Um, that is the side, that is the heel, really, really high. Um, I've worn them, I've worn them, I think, once or twice at um, family weddings. So, yeah. Um, how much did I purchase these for? I have no idea. It doesn't say it on the box. But, yeah. Um, they are my other pair of heels. So, yep. Um, I've got more heels, but I'm just trying to think if I can get into them because they're quite far back in my shoe box actually yeah i think i will be able to get into them um so my next heel is 
from new look um as you can see i'm sure you've realized i'm quite into pointy heels i really like them they look great i think they look really like posh if that makes sense or the word is or i just like them because they suit my feet better um they're not that high uh, they're from new look and i don't know how much they were as you can see the stickers even come off but yeah um, they're pointy Ooh, my next heel is from again new look i worn these quite a few times one of my uh out of my silver pair of heels these are my absolute favorite super 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 comfy as you can see it's a block um the heel is a block and it's all glitter so yeah um and that's the front of it and it's got a strap it's a strap um, on so yeah uh, next is my Dorothy Perkin heels which I purchased for £23 and I've obviously worn them as you can see they are bright orange really nice uh, really comfortable and I actually wore these on my sister's graduation um, ceremony so yeah I haven't worn them again so, but they are my next ones next is my nude heels that I haven't I've actually only wore the once which I purchased from Marks and Spencers um, as you can see they're quite shiny so I have to be really careful that I don't scratch them because as you can see I don't know how that's happened because I've only worn them once but as you can see that little scratch there I don't know if it's showing up in cam on the camera but I have to be super careful with them but yeah they are my nude heels and my next ones that I've worn a lot is my classic black heels they've got a lot of glitter on them because they've been mixed with my glitter heels but these as well they were for 25 pounds and um from marks and spencers and the heel is like a glossy one so again as you can see all these scratches you can see how much i wore them but yeah and i think i'm on my last pair of heels i'm not sure uh again the same he same uh, design as the black ones that I just showed you, but in um, what's the material? It's like a velvet material, um, and I got them on sale. Or uh, you, I don't know if you'll even believe this, but for two ninety nine, and I haven't worn them yet, and I was like bargain, bargain, bargain. But yeah, and uh, on, uh, from the sides, from underneath, it's like a snake print. And so is the heel. Oh, dropping them. And so is the heel, like a snake print. And I haven't worn them yet, but yeah, I think that's all. I'm just trying to. Oh no, one more pair. Um, is my very very first ever pair of heel. No, my second pair of heels that I've ever worn or purchased in my life are these gold ones. Um, really tiny heel. I've actually worn them quite a lot, a long, um, quite um, a few times. I forgot my words then. I was just mumbling. Um, as you can see, they are like a gold but with silver glitter in them. And yeah, these were from Outfit, but I don't remember the actual design from out the designer name company name from outfit i think it was dorothy perkins as well i'm not sure but yeah that is it at the moment i'm just having a quick look behind me so yeah they are all my um heels that i just showed you. actually no one more pair they're not heels if flats that i haven't worn and i've just recently purchased as you can see they're still in the packaging are my river island um sandals that i purchased for does it say the price it's 35 pounds i don't know if you can see that yeah 35 pounds and super cute can't wait for the summer or oh, oh, 
hopefully go on holiday or somewhere as soon as this corona is over and uh, studied they got beads on them and yeah that's all so so far that was all my heels and um flats well only two pairs of flats but yeah i thought i'll show you i've still obviously i've still got a lot of more shoes and heels but these were my ones that i haven't worn yet but except from the one odd so i thought i hope you enjoyed the video don't forget to like um share comment down below subscribe and i shall see you in the next video and follow me on all my social media that will be linked down below and um yeah thank you so much for watching i appreciate it and i shall see you next friday bye